Question number six. This is important. The velocity time graph of an object moving along a straight line is given. Draw its acceleration time graph. Now observe the graph. First, the body is moving with uniform acceleration, right? Till two seconds, and then the body moves with constant velocity, and then it moves with uniform retardation, right? Now find out the acceleration for different portions. For part O A, what is the acceleration of the body? Find slope. Perpendicular upon base. What is perpendicular? Ten base is two. So ten by two, five meter per second square. Right. This is the acceleration between zero to two seconds. Then for portion AB, the body moves with constant velocity. So acceleration is zero. Right. For portion BC, the body is moving with uniform retardation. Find out the value of retardation. This is ten. This length is two. So ten by two, five meter per second square. Body is moving with uniform retardation. That means acceleration is minus five, right? Now plot this on the acceleration time graph. So from zero to two seconds, acceleration is plus five. From two to four, acceleration is zero. From four to six seconds, acceleration is minus five. Plot it, and you will get this graph. Clear? Yeah? Zero to two. It's constant. Acceleration is constant. Plus five. Then two to four. It's zero. And then from four to six, it is minus five. Okay. Acceleration is on the y-axis. Time is on the x-axis.